This is episode, I don't know what number already, but it is time for Makina Stuff. It's another helmet feature. Don't you just love helmets? It just doesn't stop. Ooh la la, here we go. Spider! Ta ta da, ta ta da. Pretty nice packaging. Take a look. This is the Spider Phoenix 2.0. Phoenix 2.0. You see Spider all over the country. I mean, they're in the malls. They provide helmets for bicycles and, of course, motorcycles. The thing about Spider is they have always been at a certain price point that has been very reachable to everybody. They've been playing around the 2,000 peso bracket, 2,000, 3,000 plus bracket. This is one of their popular models. Now, right off the bat, let's take a quick look. You got vents here. Open. Close, open, close. La, 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 la. This has an ABS composite shell. The ABS composite shell is not as rigid as fiberglass. Now, ayaw mo naman talaga ng helmet na masyadong rigid. That's not good. It's not absorbing. Much mo ding ding. That doesn't absorb. Either bibigay yung wall or bibigay yung tumatama dun, right? If this is going to absorb it, like that. My fantastic illustration of absorption. That's gonna be better for the helmet. And according to Spider, that's why they use ABS. It's got a dual density EPS liner. The EBS naman is the material in between the fabric lining and the outer shell. Yun actually naga absorb ng shock more than the outer shell. It's that inner part there that is uh, the crucial part. Kasi kung tinanggal mo yan, at ito lang aasahan mo, at sumayang plank ka, langanin ka doon, bro. The EPS is very important. So, the EPS is also designed, I, I'd love to tear this apart, but I'm not gonna do that. You have to trust me on this one. That material underneath also has channels to direct airflow within the helmet. So, pati yan ang pag-isipan din nila. You know what? At this price point, and if you look at the lining of Spider inside, and you see the ultra-cheap helmets, you know, I have gone around, I think it was Taiwan, I saw helmets there, lumalabas mga 400 pesos or 500 pesos. I don't know, man. What kind of helmet meron dun? Ang lining nila dun sa loob, the cheaper helmets, nagnanak na. Clearly, the touches of Spider, hindi naman ganon, <laughs> diba? Check this out too. That's also on the inside, huh? Not bad. So, what does that do? It's uh, supposed to make your head cooler, of course, and add extra padding for comfort. Quick release retention system. I would guess it's this. Pull this tab over here. That's it. Pretty secure, too. Put it to the test. I don't want to in mind. The visor polycarbonate distortion free. According to Spider, one of their proud moments apart from the shock impact capability, yung visor nito, it has UV protection, it is distortion free, which means it's uh, better for your vision. They take pride in this. Again, the El Cheapo sub 1000 peso helmet na para nag helmet ka pa na hindi ka naman talaga nag helmet. It's always distorted. I used to collect all those bubble shields. Si Isganda ika nga kasi pogi siya, pero it's distorted. Minsan nakakahilo. So, uh, you should consider that. The entire lining inside, you can remove it. It's washable. So these are the standard, you know, and daming helmet brands na ganyan na yung norm. So it's good that if you're looking for a helmet, you know, these are the basic things you would want to see. Now, no gasa mo yan, syempre, di ba? Nang naman, uuwi ka sa bahay, lambuan mo na ito ginagamit, bao-bao na mukha mo. <laughs> it's got an ECE rating, as you see there, and the ICC sticker. Now, mind you, I will believe this more than an ICC sticker. Because ICC sticker, when that whole rule came about back in the day, nabibili mo yan sa OLX. <laughs> Thousand pesos. I don't know where they got that. And of course, sagulan tayo. This is another thing you would want to look at in a good helmet. The rubber here, that part there. This is designed, of course, to keep your helmet quiet, to keep rain out. This is where the rain usually seeps in. Mamaya basa basa nila mo. So it's supposed to redirect the rain to the side and away from your eyes and stuff. So check out this little detail over here. That's where the air comes out, the rear vent. Ah, it's mesh. I think that's a pretty nice touch right there. I've always been quite vocal when I say that I like plain colored helmets. So this is matte black. They also have one in matte titanium gray. Yeah, let's see how this thing fits. I can tell you right now, this is a very light helmet. But I can also tell you right now, it's about the tone of your helmet. Meaning, the frequencies na nahagilap nga. Lahat ng bagay sa buong mundo, nagre-resonate yan ng frequency. Kung meron kang sound system, meron kang equalizer. From this side would be the low frequency, the bass, the mid, and then the high. Ngayon, yung mga helmet, pagdating sa hangin, yung mga design, mga acoustic engineers, they can actually make 
the wind noise more on the lower register which is good. Kung medyo matining yung sagop ng hangin sa helmet mo, mas shrill naman yung tunog na hangin, mas nakakapagod yun sa ride. I can tell you right now, if this is the mid frequency, bass, mid, high, just by talking into it, I can tell you it's on the mid, mid to high range. Hindi naman todo high, but definitely not mid to low. It's how I'm speaking and how I can hear myself actually. Comfort wise, yes, it is very, very light which I like. So right now we're gonna ride out. So it's been raining of late, so you're gonna get gloomy footage. We're gonna ride out there and we're gonna try to tell you about the, the wind experience. <laughs> Okay, so I can tell you right now, just as I predicted, the wind that I'm getting is about mid to high frequency, it's not mid to low. Um, which is not bad because I've had other helmets. I will admit I did buy El Cheapo helmets before when I was abroad. talaga sakat sa tenga yung wind noise. The more wind noise you have in your helmet, that will equate to a very tired rider. And I always say that if you can, you know, mag earplugs na rin kayo on a long ride and you will thank me. Ang earplugs naman, ang dami kasi napapraning na, ah, di mo na yung katabi mo mga sakyan. It's not true. You can hear everything, everything's lower, hindi siya nakaka-disorient. Parang steady ka lang. You're just cool riding, di ba? At this point, I wanna do a palo test. Ah, kasi may impact, I'm gonna get earplugs. Pwede yung earplugs, dahil, kakasan yung bote ng ano, papalo mo sa ulo ko. Okay, so this is our palo test. We have a bottle of beer. You ready? Dito. Habay! Sige pa. Eh, para mo lang ako, minamartilyo ng pa ako eh. Lakasan mo. <laughs> hey, you know what? Here's a revelation. You were expecting this to shatter. That's what I mean by this absorbing shock. Kasi pag ito sobrang tigas, mababasag talaga to. Of course, I didn't feel any pain. Pero ngayon, alam ko yung pakiramdam ng pa ako. <laughs> but the thing is, you can feel that the helmet was, you know, it was absorbing the shock for lack of a better term. And also, when you're holding the bottle and you're hitting it, you can also feel the helmet parang tumatalbog yung, yung bote. Something like that. Because here in Makina, we are very thorough when we test things. Especially when they give stuff away. So 2,795 pesos. That segment is tough competition. A lot of people are in that market looking for helmets. I think this is a pretty much, I would say, bang for the buck. Huh? I would say. So, it's giveaway time. We're gonna give away this helmet. Not this one, kasi pinalo palo ko na and I'm sure you're gonna be complaining. Ah, Zay, kapag pinamigay pinalo ng bote ng beer! Ah, check it out! This is what we're giving away. Untouched virgin helmet. I'm not even gonna wear it, but I will show it to you. This is the matte gray that I was talking about. This is what we are giving away. Wow! Between the two, I like the gray one better. This is what I like. Wow, this is nice. Okay, so one lucky winner will get this helmet. It says XL here. But don't worry, you can choose ko anong helmet ang kasha sa'yo. We're gonna send you to one of the spider stores. You can fit the right helmet for you. So, uh, that's that. We're also gonna be giving away uh, some caps. So we're gonna give away this baseball cap. We have another cap here that's colored gray. Spider bag. This is a leg bag na nilalagay sa leg. <laughs> we got some spider balaclavas that I'm gonna be giving away to... There. So you put this over your face. Do all sorts of things to this. Okay, so this is what's gonna happen. Pag claim ng price, and you see yung may konting puni at medyo hindi maganda yung pagbalik, ito yung ginamit ko, pabibigay ko rin sa iyo. Ha! Kilamos naman ako eh. So, one lucky winner will get the helmet. Another winner will get the bag, the cap, and the multi-purpose fabric. I'm gonna give away four sets of these. And one winner for this. Total of five winners. One winner, the helmet, and the rest of the four, these. Huh? Not bad. How to win, it's very, very easy. All you gotta do is like and share this video with the hashtag Spider Helmets, Makina Stuff, and Makina Moto Chunky October 6th and 7th, Mega Tetley Beast. Screen cap that, put in the comments below, and we'll do the up, down, up, down, choosy woozy. There you go. Thank you so much for watching Makina Stuff. This is Zach. Ciao.